Tom. Hello everybody, Tom Fox here, welcoming you back to Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. In the last episode, we prevented Team, Aqu Team Aqua from stealing the Devon goods. And in this episode, let's talk to some people. I get all giddy and gooey when I see the sea. For me, Captain Stern is the number one role model. I want to learn about the sea and use all that knowledge for battling. I guess you'd only battle on the sea then? Oh, do you perhaps like Pokemon? I'm on an assignment with the TV network. I'm gathering current stories on Pokemon and trainers. If you don't mind, could you tell me a little bit about yourself? Sure. Oh, you will? Thank you. Then please tell me uh, anything interests you in your experience involving Pokemon. Um... I've had some pretty good butt experience. Yeah, especially with my slack off, with especially with meat, because his butt is exposed. There we go, butt experience. You don't need to put punctuations because they fill that blank in for you. No! You can't put in butts. Ah. Uh. That's what I have to say about that system. You're dumb. What an uplifting story. <laughs> I want to see Pokemon. I think it'd be cool and it'd feel cool and nice to hug. In the summer, maybe. The sea is vast and without end. It's infinitely deep. So we have any Pokemon we don't know about. You know what? I can see that girl getting a sfeel. Let's go upstairs. Because even though we just came from upstairs, all the people are suddenly here. Looking at this model ship here reminds me of Mr. Briny on Route 104. He must be famous. He must be famous. And I think that's the only- Nope, there's another person up here. Don't run around inside the museum. Wow, submarines are awesome. I want to go for a ride. Silly child, you're too big to fit in there. But you keep telling me I'm too small to go on the roller coaster and it's roughly the same size. All right, um, let's go back this way. Head on and heal all. And talk to some of these scientists. Yeah, I'm working here. I get seasick really easily, so I'm helping out here instead. The, sea the seasons, the weather, where the moon sits in the sky. These and other conditions make the sea change its expression. That's right, the sea is like a living thing. What do you got? Hey, Mr. Briney agreed to join us and lend us his knowledge and expertise. The help of a legendary sailor means the fairies' our plans are really coming together. Sweet! I can't wait to see the fairy when it's done to take me to the battle frontier. That is in this game, right? Right? What do you gotta say? Making a large ship is more like constructing a building than assembling a vehicle. Oh yeah, because people have to live on that. It's like making a big guy's big ass camper. You're an adventurer, aren't you? Have you have been to the Sea Marville? To Sea Marville and near Route 108? Nope. Aha. Uh -huh. See, Marvel is a new place. It's a building, and it's also a natural preserve. If you seek adventure, you should go there. Uh, what happens if I say yes? I'm happy to hear that. Oh, sorry. I need, need to introduce myself. I'm Captain Salty. I used to work for Sea Marvel, and now I'm still emotionally attached to that place. So I've always wanted the young people to know how great Sea Marvel is. You didn't introduce yourself when I said no. Shark. Don't you think it's strange that ships made of heavy iron floats? It's flows because of a principle called buoyancy. I invented, I coined that term. Uh, no, I didn't. Ugh. All right. It's enough moving around here. It's heavy equipment here. I can't be here. There's no place for a child. Look at me. I'm so tender and young and tender and juicy and. Sorry, I got a, I got a bit of a cannibalism streak going on here. That's the museum. I was just there. Silly Gohan. All right. What do we got here? We got. The market does, does have some interesting merchandise, but there's some items you can go get at a Pokemon. Pokemart, you know? What the hell are you? It's easier to catch Pokemon with a Great Ball than with, than with a regular old Pokeball. With this, I should be able to get that hard to get Pokemon. And that's all they have here. There's two merchants here, so one of them sells stuff, the other one sells... Let's see. Uh, no wait, that's the one that sells actual stuff. Wait, I thought one of these guys sold TMs. Nope, I must have been mistaken. Ah, oh, forget I said anything. One of them sells battle items, the other one sells regular shop items. 
We are getting an experience from this game. I need to go to the Pokemon Center. Quickly! Heal. Good evening. Yes, it's like 5, 6, 6, 7 p.m. Good lord. At the time of this recording, it's 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. What do we got? You want to know a trick to battling? If you ask me, it's raising different kinds of Pokemon in a balanced way. It's no good just making one Pokemon strong and facing a type that's, that's weak to. Might not stand a chance. You trade Pokemon with your friends, right? If the Pokemon you trade is holding an item, uh, when you send it out, it'll make them twice as happy. I When I first saw that, I thought they were referring to the Pokemon, but no, they're referring to the trainer. Uh, is this the name Raider House? Oh, what do you got here? You want to change your Pokemon's nickname to Ra the name Raider. Wait, get the name Raider to help. He lives in this town. Hell yeah. Uh, let's see. I want to change Goomba's name to Goomnut. Uh, let's see. Where's Goomba? Goomba! Yeah, I'll give it a better nickname. New nickname shall be... Goomnut! Yay! I love you, Goomnut! It's like trying to change the name of a pet after you get it. It's like the pet's known itself by this name for like a year and a half or something like that, and you just come up and you're like... Yeah, I feel like naming you, like, Fido instead of Cliff. What do we got here? I beg your pardon, you're looking for a ship? I'm sorry, the ferry service isn't available at present. A journey to the bottom of the sea, I wonder what it'd be like. I'd love to go into deep water like that someday. I wanted to go with Captain Stern in the ocean floor exploration, but the sub's too small for me. I squeezed in there, there wouldn't be any room for the captain. Mm-hmm. -hmm. But then again, I'd be squeezing with the captain. <laughs> Alright, uh, what do we got here? Do you know about the Pokeblock kit? Nope. It's a Pokeblock kit, you can make candies called Pokeblocks. Make great Pokeblocks and give them to Pokemon. Their conditions will get much better. Hmm, I wonder what that means. We got you here. Yeah, I waited so long for this Pokemon contest spectacular. I'm gonna enter. Before I do, I have to catch some Pokemon. Um... You know, I think I'll cover this later, so I'm gonna come back to this. Psych! It's forcing me to do it anyway! Hey, that- hey, that's Licia and Allie doing a shoot over there! Are you serious? Licia, let's go! Oh boy. Hi, everybody! Licia here! Me and my, my Altaria Alley have come to Slateport City's contest for Spectacular Hall for a bit of fun! Alili! Well then, watch as I dive right in it again today! Yeah! Dazzling, dizzying, doldrums defying! Dazzling, dizzy! Dazzling, dizzy! Licia's miraculous contest scouting! Start! Lisi, scout me to be your next boyfriend! Licia! Ali! Alrighty, I'm going to bring another fantastic trainer into the wild world of contesting! Eeny, meeny, miny. Mm hmm? You there, watching me with that baffled expression on your face! Hi! Have you never joined a, in a contest? That's just what I want to hear! Then let's get this show on the road! This is the trainer I'm going to scout today! And her name is... Rad Dad! When I took a good look, I could easily see that Rad Dad is a powerful trainer with several badges of her own already! Rad Dad, you can enjoy contest spe spectaculars at the Pokemon Contest Hall right here! Now listen up, because I don't just want to see you making your Pokemon strong, I want to see you bring bringing out a whole new brilliant side of sh them showing off to show off so here you go, take these! This is a contest pass, which is the first thing that anyone uh, needs to, to take part in a Pokemon Contest Spectacular. And this one is a Pokeblock kit, which will let you make Pokeblocks for your Pokemon out of berries. Got the contest pass. And the Pokeblock kit. Alright. Rad Dad's story begins today. Yup, and this chapter sh should be titled... A sudden encounter, miraculous contest scouting. That's what I'd call it. Now everybody out there watching, you'd better expect great things from Red Dad because I do. 
That's it for today's Lysia's Miraculous Contest Scouting. See you all next time. Altari! Clap, clap, clap. Lacey, you're so cute. If you feel up for it, try your hand in a contest uh, for me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Whew. A little bit hard to keep doing that. Especially with Lisey's en or with uh, Alicia's energy. Good lord. I love the remix of this. Kind of reminds me of uh, the Twilight, uh, Twinkle Park in um, in Sonic Adventure. Lisa, uh, Lissy and Allie's performance up on stage is amazing. They're unbeatable. Wow, you got scouted by the one and only L Lysia? You're so lucky. Lysia and Allie are like the idols of the contest spectacular circuit. Everyone looks up to them. Lisa, give me your autograph, and I want Allie's footprint too. Ali, Ali! All right, let's talk to. What's this woman got to say? What should I do? I can't come up with an idea for a really fashionable Pikachu costume. I wonder if I can get some inf inspiration from seeing a wonderful trainer at a contest spectacular. A wonderful trainer, you say? All right, let's see. Hello, Alicia. Oh, Rad Dad, thanks for playing along back there. I guess it was quite a sh the shock, huh? But don't mind that. Contests are really fantastic, you know. I'm sure you'll get hooked on them. I think I'm pretty sure I had to do something. See. You can take a picture of Pokemon during the contest spectacular. You can upload the photo to the Pokemon Global link using GameSync. I'm going to brag about my Pokemon globally. Let's see. Oh, okay. It's triggered by going up to the counter. Oh, Rad Dad! Could it be? Oh, could it? Could it? Are you really going to try a contest for me? Oh, I'm happier than a gloom with a sunstone. Ah, I know this chapter of your story should definitely be called... My big beginning, a heart-pounding contest debut. That's what I'm calling it. Oh, but if you're gonna take the stage, you've gotta come with me here for, uh, with me, come here with me first. Jesus, I gotta remember to read the whole thing before I actually start saying it. So, if you're taking on the contest spectacular, there's something you have to have from me. <laughs> I know it's sudden, sorry. Truth is, you're actually the hundredth trainer that I've scouted, Rad Dad. That's a really big deal, you know. It's gotta be fate, right? Mm -hmm. I think you're just the trainer I've been looking for. Oopsie, sorry. I got a little carried away. But um, the point was, would you like to, well, do you think, um, wanna, wanna wear this for your costume debut? Rad Dad obtained the cost contest costume. I guess I gotta change into it for this thing. Yup. It's a pink version of Lysia's costume. So, 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 so cute! Oh wow, it fits perfect for you. Eee, I just can't wait. Your first time on on a live stage contest on a contest stage, Rad Dad. It's gonna be so 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 awesome. It, I'm not gonna blink for even a second. Phew! You look so fantastic in that outfit that I'm about to lose it here. You have to wear this cost contest costume. It'll be. Perfect for the contest, promise! Yeah! I'll be cheering for you! Ooh! I, re I really hope you'll win! Jesus, putting all of that energy into her. Alright, so we got a few options here. What do you have to say? I'm in charge of preparing the contest hall for everyone. If you'd like, I can create a special effect during the talent round of the contest hall. Do you want me to do that? Uh, no. I think what this does is it, um, is it activates the camera on your 3DS so your Pokemon are performing whatever your camera's pointed at. Let's see. Hey, man, I'm, like, majorly cheesed, you know? Like, you know, I just wanted to know why my Pokemon never won. Like, how? So, like, I gave the judge of two, uh, my two cents, you know? They're free. And he wouldn't hear me out. Like, hey, so, like, total buzzkill, man. Hey, hey, you, like, zip it, you know? Just, you know, take this. Torment. It's a representation of his eternal torment. That's like torment, you know? Hey, you you hearing me? Like, it won't let the other guy use the same move twice in a row, see? Hey, now, you listen here. Like, I'm not laying a torment on you. 
And these are all, I believe, photos of your Pokemon that can, uh, where your, where photos of your Pokemon can go when they win the contest. What do you have to say? What do you have to say? I want to raise a Pokemon that's the strongest, strongest and the best for both battles and any contest spectacular. It's vexing trying to figure out which moves I should make it learn. Speaking of that, I think next time we're going to go ahead and enter one of these contests. It, uh, off, off screen, uh, well, maybe not off screen, but I will go over how the Pokeblock kit works, um, before I go on to the contest, because I do need to feed my Pokemon Pokeblock. So, next time, on Pokemon Alpha Sapphire, see you all then.